Jesse Jacobs, Unite the Union. I was going for a run this week and I met a young girl and she was distressed, crying and walking into the sea. Concerned, I stopped to see what was going on and asked if everything was okay. I used to be a youth worker, so I did what good youth workers do. I stopped, I listened, I cared, I offered advice. And hopefully I made a difference. But it concerned me. Because who would she have talked to if not a stranger on the beach? Suicide rates amongst young women are at their highest point in recorded history. In 10 years, the rates have nearly doubled. Self-harm and eating disorders are on the rise. The feeling of not being able to cope experienced by that young woman is a national and a growing trend. But meanwhile, our youth services have been decimated. Youth clubs and sure start centres closed down. Early interventions all but gone. Those free dance classes that provided a respite have disappeared. Child mental health services over capacity, schools stretched, and councils facing unprecedented cuts. By 2020, authorities will receive £15.7 billion pounds less than they were in 2010. And who is this hurting? It's hurting those girls on the beach, those young people in Teesside, women and children. These women are our future leaders, mothers, engineers, teachers, surgeons, maybe labour leaders. They need support, care and guidance to be all that they can be. We need to be opening more youth services, not closing them. Recruiting youth workers, not making them redundant. Providing a career service, not taking it away. The government wants councils to fend for themselves, fund services through our own earned income. Raise your own taxes, the Tories say. Well, I've got a message for the Prime Minister and her supposedly One Nation Party. Have you ever been to the North East? Have you seen our high streets? Our shops are closed down and the businesses are gone. The businesses aren't coming back and our steelworks have gone. We've got nowhere to go to raise more taxes. We're selling off everything that we own. Our land, community centres, libraries, but it's not enough. It has to stop. We urgently need a Labour government. A radical Jeremy Corbyn-led Labour government that will end austerity, stop the cuts, give our councils back the money. Give our councils back the money that has been stolen by the bankers when they crashed this economy. We, we're paid the price for what they did. We need the money to keep our communities thriving and support to keep our children and young women healthy, safe and alive. Thank you, Conference.